What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another highly combustible reaction. We're jumping in the next one on our Emily Linga journey. Coming out, it's from Brad Shadow Side from AHA. Definitely learning that there's a lot more to this group than previously thought. 100% a whole new respect because of all the AHA covers of songs that we didn't even know existed. And then I go back and, uh, you know, we got to check out the originals. Uh, let's jump in. Let's check it out together. See what she did with it. Get over, show her all the love of the world if you enjoy it. It's right there inside the description. The link shall be. The shadow side you say I have is making everything go bad. You say I don't care enough for all the things that I have got, but I do. She's just got this emotional depth to her voice. It's like when she takes on a song, she becomes something else. She goes from being this person that's just like a laughable person like you and me, like, hey. And then she steps into a role and she becomes dead serious. And then you're going to see like a little hint or a wink at the end. And it's just like she goes back to being that person she was before she did the song. It's a crazy duality that goes on with her. I absolutely enjoy every single moment of this. I don't want to see It's heartbreaking. You can feel it. Into the shadow side again. If you ever let me go again in the shadow side, I'll end. The shadow side, where I go, I'm never. It's so very, very real. A lot of people out there fighting with things. A lot of people out there have their bad days and bad enough days that interfere with things like relationships. Like, there's a lot of people out there who maybe are so busy that they don't say what's on their mind. That they don't say I love you enough. That they don't say I care for you. They don't show the appreciation for the things that they got. And someone's got to remind them. But this is like that other side of the argument. Like, no, I really do care. I just have this thing going on. Communication is key. If you're not having a good day, just tell your significant other that, hey, it's not that I don't care. I'm just having a, like, that person is there to pull you out. It's a two, it's like a whole double thing. You help them, they help you. It's supposed to be communication. It's supposed to be talking. Sadly enough, today's day and age, nobody talks to anybody anymore, even in relationships, which is crazy to me. They're right there. I know family members that text each other from across the house. Go down and speak to someone face to face. Talk to one another. That's the way to keep from having a broken heart, especially in a relationship. Talk. If I th always thought Aha uh -huh was like fun and upbeat and happy, and this is proving me wrong. Again. I have been humble. If you're letting go of me again in the 
shadow side, but I do. Definitely. See, see, there's the wink. You see it just like this little. I'm back, and it's so crazy to me how she could be this person over here. She's 16. She just turned 16. That's the time to be out having fun and all. But she loves what she does, and then she steps into this whole new character every single performance, and you're just like, whoa. It can be fun. It can be upbeat. It can be sad. It can be very, very real. It can be painful. It can be anything with her. Whatever she covers, she absolutely smashes it. Get over, show her all the love of the world. Let's get her up to that one million mark where she belongs. Smash that like button if you like it. The dislike button, but I won't believe you. Shout out to get the Brad for the request. Tell the next one of my the combustible. You guys be happy, healthy, safe. I love you to the moon and back. Peace.